The multiverse is already open. You have already witnessed this in Spider-Man No Way Home. A lot of returning villains was able to come through the multiverse. This returning villain is not just your average wielding Infinity Stones type of villain. She's collecting farts and selling them online. <sighs> yes, you've heard that fucking right. She's selling farts. I found out about this story just recently and was not expecting 2021 to end with a blast. So this lady had this amazing idea of farting inside a jar and selling it online, who has now earned $200,000. No big deal, it's just $200 fucking dollars. Meet Stephanie Maddow. She became an instant celebrity for the 90 Days Fiance show, and for some reason she got a lot of traffic from whatever god forbid arc story she got in a TLC multiverse. I was really having a hard time thinking about making money, because living a minimum wage independently is never enough. As why people divert into the smartest possible passive income that is out there. As why people divert into OnlyFans. But at the same time, not a lot of people has the courage to do OnlyFans. Like Gwyneth Paltrow, because she started her own vagina scented candles. Yes, a candle, scented candle that smells like her vagina. But at the same time, not everyone has a good smelling vagina. <laughs> But thank God, Stephanie Maddow introduced us to the idea of selling farts. You just don't get it. You just don't get it. I'm, I mean, I just want you all to calm down. I, Cause I know, I know, I know you have a lot of questions in mind. Like, what does it smell like? I made a hundred thousand dollars selling my farts in a jar. And this was in the 15th of December. She already made a lot of money by then. Hi everyone, how are you all doing today? So let's have a seat at my kitchen counter. Ow! Oh my god, okay, she okay, does okay. So kitchen. I know it's been a while. I have been very, very busy. Oh, hold on, hold on. Those are the jars that she's selling. And these are probably what you're gonna smell after it has been filtered. New business venture, which has just been exploding. It's all over the internet, which is pretty crazy. I never ever expected this. Honestly, I never did started I selling farts about three weeks ago. And in addition to jarring my farts, I've also been selling videos of myself making the, the jarred fart. I've been using my unfiltered account to sell these farts. I'm the type of person that has learned over the years to never kink shame, to always be open and accepting of people's weirdness and oddities. And so I was- You know, <laughs> I mean, pretty much at this point, you can sell anything the fuck you want. Fucking like clip your nails and just put them inside a condom. Sell them online for a hundred bucks and you can make money out of it. Hey guys, today I'm going to be showing you a day in the life of a girl who sells her farts in a jar. So I like to get things rolling with some beans, a protein some muffin, beans. sometimes even a yogurt, less sugar is better, some hard boiled eggs. And She's eating all of this at the same time so she could form the fart. Am I getting this right? Or she's like flavoring jars. She's flavoring jars. Did I just realize that? The moment that I knew, like, wow, I've really made it was when Lance Bass from InSync commented on my jarred farts TikTok. P.S. Lance, if you'd like a jar for free, I'd love to send you one. So just let me know. Bruh, Why bruh, me? bruh, hold it right there. He was just confused with what you're selling. That doesn't mean he wants to smell your shit. <laughs> I made $45,000 in one week selling my jars of farts. And ever since my last TikTok went viral, I've been getting a lot of questions such as, how long do the farts last? Did I really fart 97 times in two days? Who buys my farts and why? And what are some of my tips and tricks? She fucking hated that. <laughs> the moment she opened that jar, she fucking hated that. <laughs> she fucking hated that. And trip. Like, how do people actually unbox the fart like do they like just like open it and get a little sniff or they put they shove their nose down to get the whole experience i'm confused i mean i'm interested to know otherwise if you're just gonna get a whiff of that then it's not gonna be worth any money right unless you shove down your fucking nose into it and get that <laughs> Wait, how much is it? A jar? Her fans could buy her farts in a jar for a hundred a thousand dollars. Is there a certificate of authenticity with it? How can you be sure you're getting the right fart? Exactly. If I started selling farts, then people wouldn't know if I'm actually farting right. But you know, of course, all good things come to an end. Well, she's already retired. 
Why? Because farting in a jar for 500 times a day is not fucking normal. A TikTok star Stephanie Maddow hospitalized for severe chest pain due to excessive farting for her business. Stephanie Maddow's bottled farts were so high that she was almost selling 50 jars a week at one point. And the star had to give up her, on her business after a health scare and she announced her retirement from selling farts after she was rushed to the hospital. She had consumed three protein shakes and a huge bowl of black bean soup the day she was rushed to the hospital. It was quite hard to breathe and every time I tried to breathe in, I'd feel a pinching sensation around my heart, she recalled. Oh, and it turns out she had, she just had a really intense gas pain. It's just a shame that things didn't go out the way it should. Like reshaping the whole world like people actually investing or selling each other's farts because i would absolutely pay an enormous amount of money just to get a whiff of that tom hanks fart jar that's a premium fart jar you get it that toy story woody type of flavor well just wanted to tell a quick story about stephanie maddow i just think it's an interesting one but i will say this if you're someone who's scared starting a business just fucking do it because people nowadays are doing a lot of fucking stupid dumb shit Eh, that's all I have to say. Nothing else, really. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe. If this video gets 100 likes, I would fart in a jar and sell it. And not actually, I'll give it for free. Bye.